Hello guys, in this video we will see how to install WordPress on Windows 11 operating system. The process is same for Windows 10 or Windows 11 or Windows servers also. So first go to wordpress.org. That is the official website wordpress.org. Click on this get WordPress. See here the latest version at the time of making this video is WordPress 6.5.2 but, but the prerequisites are PHP 7.4 or greater MySQL version 8.0 or MariaDB version 10.4 or greater. Okay. So to install these one by one, to install these one by one, it is a big task. To meet all these requirements, I am going to so go to Apache Friends dot org. Then click on see here PHP version is 8.2.12. Okay. So click on download. Then click on download for the Windows. So click on the first one or any of this. So I am going with the latest one that is 8.2.12. Okay, click on this download 64 bit. Wait, it is going to download automatically. See, download has been started. Its size is 150 megabytes. Wait until this download completes. See, download has been completed. Go to downloads. Click on this installer exe file. Click on next. Click on next. It is going to install all these components. Click on next. See, it, it is going to create folder in this directory. Click on next. Search the language. That is okay. Click on next. Click on next. Keep this checkbox as it is and click on finish. Click on Apache. Click on MySQL. See Apache is running. Start. See MySQL also started. Then start file jilla. Hello access. Start Mercury. Start Tomcat. Okay, we have started all the modules. Okay, now download the WordPress. Click on download. Download has been started. Go to downloads. See, its a size is 25 megabytes. Go to folders, right click on it, extract them, extract, go to this folder, copy this folder, then go to XAMPP installed directory, C drive, it is there, then htdocs, paste WordPress here. Now go to panel, click on this admin, then click on MySQL or simply close this one, give the local host. Click on PHP php my admin then databases so provide the name for new database so i am giving the database name as wordpress then select the collation setting i am going with same as this one that is okay not going to change then click on create see database wordpress is created now go to the xam folder rename this wordpress as whatever you like okay I am renaming it as Artoscus hit enter now go to localhost then give the Artoscus hit enter select the language I am ok with English United States then click on continue Click on let's go. So here 
we have to select the database database name is first wordpress that we have created give the same admin provide the username pa password is username is root password keep blank and database host local host then click on submit it is done now click on run the installation see this is the password even if you want remember this password or provide password whatever you like then provide the email i am giving username also same site title i am giving artoscos tutorials okay then confirm because it is pa e password then click on install you have to remember this password and this username click on install wordpress never now we have successfully installed now click on login see this is the login console press at gmail click on login see you have successfully see you have successfully installed wordpress and connected to wordpress okay so if you want to create post or if you want to modify anything you have to click on add themes then you can download the themes you can search here and you can download then you have to click on activate okay so if you want to view the site click on visit site see this is the site so in this video we have seen how to download and install wordpress on windows 11 operating system as i told you earlier it is same for all windows operating system for more videos please subscribe my channel thank you